Welcome to the video series, The Slit Lamp Exam. This video explains the use of indirect illumination in the slit lamp exam. It covers the following topics. Illumination principle. Usage. Specific advantages. Slit lamp setup. And how to apply the technique. Illumination principle. Indirect illumination, or sometimes referred to as proximal illumination, is a technique where the light scatters from the directly illuminated section into the adjacent tissue where it provides a secondary field of examination. It can be used in all structures that are not completely opaque or completely transparent, for example the lid margins, the conjunctiva, or the corneal limbus. Furthermore, it can sometimes also be used in the examination of the cornea, especially to view the opacity in an otherwise clear cornea. Specific advantages. Indirect illumination can provide a qualitative assessment of translucent tissues, such as in this conjunctiva. The scattered light fills and illuminates the entire lesion to show that it's filled with clear fluid and that there is no blood or scar tissue present. In contrast, this is an example where the light is absorbed by the pigment in the melanoma and does not scatter through the opaque lesion into the surrounding structure. Another advantage is that it provides a field with a reduced light intensity for the structures adjacent to the directly illuminated field. For example, in this lid margin, the cystic structure is better visible in the indirectly illuminated field than in the direct illumination, where the detail is washed out. To set up the slit lamp, choose a moderate to high light intensity and slit width of 1.5 to 2 mm. Set the illumination angle between 30 degrees and 50 degrees. Choose a magnification of 10 times to 16 times. Zoom in if required. To use the technique, bring the area of interest just next to the slit beam. Since the observed area lies directly adjacent to the focal area of the slit beam, the focus is nearly on the same plane and you will have a focused image. Thank you for watching. The Hogstride team wishes you a lot of success in using this illumination technique. This episode was made possible with the following contributions.